Our animal control people are usually used to, to foul odors, but it was so horrific that they had to call in our first responders. More than 75 animals were found inside this Walker County home, and an estimated 70 more were found outside. There's been seven deceased animals thus far that uh, have been found inside the house. Chairman of Walker County Government Shannon Whitfield says it's a case of animal neglect. When you put uh, 75 plus animals in a 1300 square foot home, that's uh, quite horrific because many of these were large dogs. Now the scene has been deemed hazardous and that's why I have a face mask on right now. And Whitfield told me for law enforcement to be able to enter the residence right behind me, they needed to have an oxygen mask, oxygen tank and a hazmat suit. Now there's been multiple different types of animals rescued at this house. As you can see right behind me, we've had chickens, dogs, pigs, goats and more. There's a lot of uh, evidence of neglect of these animals. Whitfield tells us they have been to the property multiple times for violations outside the home, but never had enough evidence to obtain a warrant to go inside. They got enough evidence this week and had some uh, some tips that uh, allowed us to get that uh, search warrant to get inside the house, and that's where we found the most devastation. And when police got to the home, there was a there was a a weapon that was presented uh, by Jerry Bryan, and so the officers had to. Uh, to, to draw their weapons, unfortunately, but fortunately no one uh, had to fire a shot. Jerry Bryant and Patricia Bryant are the homeowners who now face multiple charges. Uh, animal cruelty, animal neglect, obstruction of an officer. Reporting in Chickamauga, I'm Abby Walton for News Channel 9. Thanks for watching News Channel 9, and for more great local coverage, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. News Channel 9, depend on us.